Whoa, that's something. That's a <laughs> if I didn't think that bridge was beautiful enough as a historic piece of transportation, let's call it that. This bike just whizzed by me and playing jazz music loud, like wow, he's playing jazz. I never heard anybody biking and playing jazz music. That's really a that's what I love about life. There's always you think you've seen it all, there's always gonna be something you've never seen happen before. Anyway, Elton here in Laval, just over the river, which is why that bridge is there, just over the river from Montreal. And, uh, oh, that beetle. And, um, and of course, as usual, you know, me, I come by the tracks to see if I can film a freight. Uh, but, uh, no, that's not going to happen. That only ever happened once, and that was actually, yes, across the bridge over there, which is on uh, Gouin Boulevard. Boulevard Gouin. And, uh, but it's a, this is a beautiful part of Laval, this street right here. It's waterfront homes, you know. And, uh, yeah. And actually, I, I never filmed, I don't think I ever did a walking video here, actually, quite frankly. Oddly enough. And, uh, just to show you here. Man, that's, that's terrible. Look at those leaves. You can't see nothing here. Look at that. C'est quoi cette rue-là? I can't even see what the hell it says. Ah, yo, somebody needs to do some trimming. But it's, it's night and day. You got all these wonderful homes you're going to see here. And then you got this street over here. Well, oh my God, look at that Tercel. How come this thing is surviving? It's, oh my God, that thing's like 30 years old. And he was playing Right Said Fred. I don't believe it. <laughs> That's really old school. I love it. Okay, Laval is totally impressing me right now. That's just like, that's awesome. But um, anyway, so this is whatever your, your poor blue collar area. You got a nice uh, GMC that I don't know what the hell model it's called. This was the, uh, the model that took over the top kick. Hey, am I going to see the freaking sign here or what? I like to show where I am in these videos, you know? Oh, this is Is it Levike or am I wrong? I'm probably wrong there because I don't live here. Ah, oh, c'est Poirier. No. It's Poirier? No, it's Prairie. Ah, it's the Prairie. Ah, ben là. Ah, ben là, là. C'est quoi ça? Oh, I thought it was vintage for a moment. I was hoping it was vintage. Boy, this walk is already starting to be very, very interesting. Ah, the Alte de Prairie. Oh, well, I should probably be doing this in French, but uh, whatever, it's too late. So, what can I tell you? Soon, soon. I'll do another video in French soon there. So, wait en français bientôt. Je sais pas test. Hey, look at this old garage here. Look at that. Man, that's as old as the hills. Eh? And what am I doing on this side? The lighting's bad on this side. Yeah. I think I saw an old Dodge Ram Charger here once. I took a photo of a big 4x4. Hey, there's a nice Cadillac. Good looking, good looking piece of GM junk. Speaking of junk, I see scrap coming. Oh boy, look at that motorhome. That reminds me, I want to go take one of those new flyers. I actually thought about that earlier. One of the new flyers they got in service. There's three of them in service. But uh, uh, I, I didn't mention it, but I'm freaking tired today. I'm just like wiped out. Really, you know? I'm just. Uh, I don't know, just really tired today. Just, I did a walking video on this street once though, on this street park. I remember that. I remember that garage. What? 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 Yeah, they both your shacks, the nice old shacks right here, vintage shacks. Documenting, documenting. It's avant, avant means for sale, but then again, if you can't figure that out, I don't know. I don't remember really ever walking on this part of the street before, actually. So anyway, yeah, I'm, uh, I was thinking about going to this car show that I go to at uh, Café Laval, but uh, really I was actually thinking about this other one going on on, uh, what's it called, Curie Labelle and uh, Dagenet, and I'm like, I'd have to take a fucking half hour bus ride to go there. I already feel like a schnook as it is taking the buses to go to car shows. I don't like that, you know? Like if I go to Julep, all I gotta do is take, that's redundant, eh? All I gotta do is take the, the metro. If I go to that show at Saint Laval, I take the metro to, to Metro Montmorency at the end of the line. You see? 
Do you see what I mean? Yeah, this looks like a nice treat to go cruising. Cruising in a vintage Thunderbird or a Skylark. Or, uh, oh wow, I really want in the hell are you doing? What kind of driving is that? What kind of fucking driving is that? Oh my god, as I forgot to tell Ben, I was talking to him before, what I saw last week when I was at the Metro, uh, I was almost at Metro, uh, I was almost at um, Longay Metro Station, right? Okay? And there's like, you know, the, the highway there, right? The 15. And, uh, oh, look. And anyway, this guy. You know, there's an exit ramp. You know, what does he do? He stops at the exit ramps. Stops right at the exit ramp, right at the entrance of it. <laughs> I'm not kidding you. And backs up to go in the other lane. I mean, you know, you're literally next to a highway, for Christ's sake. Who the hell does that? Hey, c'est moi, c'est le grand. That's me. Le grand, the big guy. Big man. Yeah. And a big dog. <laughs> big dog. <laughs> big, big. How much of one of these places go for, eh? Mm. Mm -hmm. Big black pickup, big black Dodge, big black wheels. Not surprising. That's become the main say, unfortunately. And I can't believe this is a BMW. What the fuck were they smoking? No, no, seriously. I mean, really. What the fuck were they thinking at BMW when they thought of this goddamn thing? That is the most, probably their most embarrassing model ever made. I mean, I think it almost makes a Fiat like this look amazing. Even though it's not. You can see you got some nice shacks here, nice homes. Look at this, eh? This looks like something an architect would have designed, actually. I just realized something. Am I on 100 ASA? Am I on the right setting? I'm not sure, actually. Kind of sunny, kind of overcast. Getting kind of hungry. I don't know where I'm going to stop this. I remember there was a restaurant, I think, somewhere around here. You know? Ooh, Parisi. Parisi. That's the name of a Sopranos character that gets whacked, if I'm not mistaken. See, these people, they got money, right? Mercedes and all this, or so it seems. Even if I had money, I would never own a house like that. As much as I'm old school, because I already live in an apartment that's very dark like this on the inside, and I hate it. I want to get out of there next year. I want to get into an apartment that was made in the 50s and up. Big windows, bright. You know, floors are leveled. Wasn't built on sedentary rock for Christ's sake. There's the river right there. Yeah, that quaint little home there. Boy, that would look like it was definitely not always there, that's for sure. Got some nice houses here. Very nice. Nice place. Look at that beautiful. Whoa. Flat primer gray 37. Look at that. The, wow, look at that wall. Very nice. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. This looks like one of the original houses to this street. This looks like a house that was probably made like 70, 80 years ago, probably. You know? Where am I walking to? Well, I'm walking west, that's for sure. I don't know where the hell I'm going to specifically. And unfortunately, I don't even have any money on me to to, to, <laughs> to take the bus, actually. So, I'm re what the hell is this name? What is this? Bon Pasteur. Oh, boy, why? They sont pas trop bons de ce ci on dirait. I was just saying in French, because a pasteur, I think, is a priest, if I'm not mistaken. And, uh... Yeah, you know, they've gotten some bad press, eh, over the years, eh? But, you know, everything's, everything's fucking bound to happen. What are you going to do? Again with the sirens. I'm missing whatever's going on over there. Shit! I think that's because Highway 15. I'm walking towards Highway 15. Autoroute Gains! Look at this. A business. Out of business. It's, looks like it could have been a dip in there, maybe. Yeah. What? God, look at that. There's a sculpture there. Oh, that's weird. And that house looks spooky, man. There's actually a few sculptures there. I'm actually thinking that it could be an artist that made those that lives there, actually. Oh, wow, look at that. Holy cow. Man, does that reek 1950s or what? I love it. It looks like there should be a 53 Plymouth Park there or something. Or a Dodge or a Chrysler. Or a Ford Custom Line or a Rambler. Or a Biscayne. A lot of uh, 
A lot of travel trailers. What the hell is this? Sequesa. Yeah, you know what? I don't think I'm going to go to those car shows. Plus, there's not barely any breeze. It's hot as hell, and I'm already tired. I've had a headache for most of the day. I'm just not feeling it. I want to just go somewhere and get a bite and, you know... Take it real slow today, man. Take it real slow. Well, now we're at uh, Des Marteaux, which would translate to in English, the hammers. Check that out. How often do you see a house with a solarium like that? That's really neat. I like that. Look at that. Even that gray on that Malibu is weird. And here comes the scrap. Speaking of weird. Ibrid. Junk. How fucking weird this is. I don't know, it kind of looks like a compound or something. What do I know? What do I know? Holy mackerel, this looks like an allergic allergic nightmare over here. La rue Brian. Not Brian, Brian. Brian, Brian. Oh, look. Oh boy, this place looks abandoned. It's got to be abandoned. Not abandoned, but closely. Look at this. I love these Intrepids, but this one is in bad shape, man. Looks like it's ready for the scrapyard. I actually like to make a video one of these, find one that's like mint. I mean, really clean, and that, where basically I would see it, and it would, I would have to like film, you know. Let's put this cross over here. Well, let's go take a look. Let's go take a look. On va aller voir ça. G H S M and M. What is this? Uh, Mm -hmm. It's pretty nice though. This is uh... hmm. Oh, it says uh, this was uh, made up as a place of uh, worship for prayer. Going over a hundred years ago. La Croix Vanier. The Vanier Cross. Well, all right then. Yeah, man. Mustang Sally now, baby. Guess you better slow your Mustang down. I love seeing cars with colors. My God, it's become like a... How should I say? Not a lost art, but it's become a, like... Just, I don't know, like not cool to have a car that's a color nowadays, it seems. And by the way, don't give me this fucking shit that black, gray, and white, and silver are colors. They're not technically colors. I should know. I'm an artist, for crying out loud. I'm all about colors. My art is all about colors. You know? Hmm. This looks like a residence, eh? A folks' residence. Mm -hmm. A little uh, place of rest here. I don't know, maybe I will go up to the... F I think I'm going to do this to the 15, maybe, because I hear the 15, Highway 15, coming up. And then I'm going to go up to Cartier, probably. I want to go somewhere. Like I said, I'm getting hungry. I want to go get a, a bite to eat. I still might go to that car show, but pff, not likely at this point. It's still a, be a hell of a walk to go there from here. And it's already 6.22, and I smell something good. It smells like La Belle Provence or something. What's this? That's a house? That's a house. Okay, that's definitely an architect that had to design that. That's man, not only do I think it's an architect that designed that house, it's so different. Look at that, it's all on an angle. Even the garage, even look at a, even the way all the whole uh, there's no grass or anything. It looks like you could park uh, oh I would say uh, oh, you could probably park about five Cadillacs from the past there totally right now, you know, a few Lincolns. That's very uh, very interesting, very different. Interesting indeed. Yeah, I hear that highway more and more. I hear it. It's up there somewhere. Yes, sir. Rue, Rue Dusso. Dusso Street. Was this an orphanage or something? Look at that. That is your typical 
Canadian home right there, that huge roof like that. Very Canadian, uh, as it's called. I'm sure that's what that is. Not that I'm an expert in home types or whatever, you know. Hmm. Oh, look at this, eh? Somebody got their modest uh, old house here with a freshly freshly painted driveway with uh, that tar or whatever the hell that paint that they put on there. Be nice if there was an oldie that would drive by it would seem like it this looks more you know this looks like the laval version of lakeshore boulevard and point claire and all that beaconsfield eh? seriously except uh, version francaise eh? And uh, by the way, if you're enjoying any of this jazz, and uh, you guys know that uh, I'm not... Uh, oh, look at this, eh? It's this old vet over here. Yeah, it looks like an early 80s vet there. Like, uh, what, 80, 81, 82, last year's for that body, 82. Anyway, like I was saying, if you're, uh, yeah, if you're a fan of uh, this video and other videos you watch, and you can see I'm not full of shit, and I appreciate anybody's support in uh, what I do, well, uh, you can uh, show your love and send me a... Uh, as I call it a gratuity, uh, through my email by PayPal or an e-transfer in Canada, and that's uh, my email is Elton McFall, E-L-T-O-N McFall, M-C-F-A-L-L, Elton McFall at Hotmail.com. Yes, I still have Hotmail. I never changed it because my business cards, you know. Giroux. Flippers. Oh, tabarnak. Look at this Corvette. Woo, buddy. Oh, man. Looks awesome, sounds awesome, and the color is awesome. That's a win-win right there. Okay. Oh, I think I'm going to be ending this here in a moment because again, holy mackerel! <laughs> holy shit, man! Okay, that was definitely had to have been a severe storm that did that because, uh, man, that tree's like what over a hundred years old. Look at this gorgeous house! Holy mackerel! Really nice. Really nice. Anyway, uh, yeah, so uh, now i got to figure out how the hell I'm, where the hell I'm going to go from here. I'm going to, I think, stop this like at the next street or so. I don't feel like walking forever. Like I said, I was already tired today to begin with. I have a headache. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to stop this. I don't know. I think the next street, I thought Highway 15 was closer, but anyway. Yeah, like that forward. fun though I love walking in these old areas that's what a reason why I always one of the big reasons why I love to film these walking videos in old sectors of any town it doesn't matter if it's residential or commercials because generally speaking you know every building can look different from the next or they'll look similar but they're not the same you know what I mean uh, you'll never find me making a walking video in in a newer area it's just unless it becomes an old area or vice versa you know what I'm saying Look at that, there's a huge driveway. Somebody's got a big fucking pad down there and uh, yeah. Oh my God, I'm hungry. Oh, there's the 15. Look, there's the 15 right over there. Check that out. Look at that. Yeah. Well, I said I was gonna film to the 15. Well, you know what, close enough. That's close enough, man. I'm gonna head to uh, the next street that's parallel to this is Cartier, so. I think I remember there was a restaurant near there or something I'll find and uh, yeah thanks again for watching guys merci de regarder puis si vous autres en fran francophone là, je m'excuse c'est vrai j'oublie tout le temps de faire une vidéo en français parce que <laughs> je fais toujours ça comme dernière minute puis là c'est comme euh, tu sais je fais mon intro en anglais puis c'est ça qui est ça tu sais fait que je vais essayer de me souvenir pour la prochaine fois I was just saying to my uh, very francophone uh, uh, viewers that I'll be uh, making a video for them soon in French and I was just that I always get every time I start one of these videos I start talking in English just by habit oh my god he's walking his cat I've never seen anybody do that people tell me to walk my cat I can't do that where I live I live in a ghetto for Christ's sake she's gonna get mauled or eat poison or something I don't know okay guys take care Bunswati all the best bye bye